When I graduated, I spoke at the, I can never keep them straight, the convocation ceremony. Um, and it was kind of a, uh, I had five minutes, right? So you can't say much in five minutes, but it was, I used it as a chance to make the case for, um, for religious people and Mormons in particular to engage with contemporary art. Um, and just like looking back at the work that you made as an artist when you were in your early 20s, um, as I look back at that talk or as I read it, um, uh, there are so many ways that the case could be made a lot better um, than I think our religion uh, or the culture of our religion has um, a an innate distaste for uh, some of the things that they see in the contemporary art world. And I think that, um, uh, I think there's a lot to be gained if we can get over some of our, uh, some of our prejudices and get over some of the cultural things that um, keep us from engaging with, with this work. I think that there are uh, really, um, profound things that we can learn from engaging with art and and engaging with difficult art and challenging art and ugly art. Um, and so I want to um, explore um, how uh, religious people uh, can approach looking at difficult or ugly art um, and why it's worth doing it.